Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. Find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another top 10 list. This time we're talking about the top 10 best toy reveals of the week. This may be a recurring video. If you guys enjoy it, let me know. Let's get started. So first things first, I'm going to go through all the reveals that did not make the top 10 and did not make honorable mention so we can be aware of what was revealed this week. So stay tuned and we'll get to the honorable mentions and the top 10. But here we go. So first off, we did have some Marvel Legends that leaked out this week. Someone was able to purchase the entire wave of the Eternals with the Gilgamesh Build-A-Figure. So very blurry images, but uh, definitely not a top 10 this week. Marvel Legends also gave us an in package and loose images of the Firestar exclusive figure with Miss Lion. And had we not already seen a reveal of this, this might have made our top 10 this week as well. Here's some nice action photos of her with both head sculpts on and Miss Lion. So, official images of the first wave of McFarlane Toys, the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt figure. So, here is Drop of Riviera in his box. We saw the figure loose before, but here he is actually in package on the front, back, and side of that package. And here are the figure images that we had seen before. Really nice looking figures. Here is Aradine Breck Glass in his package, front back side. And the figure images that we had seen before. And then here is the 12 inch Geralt figure in package. And the previous images that we had seen. You see the figure stand is much wider on this 12 inch figure. Got those double swords on his back. So then sticking with McFarlane toys we have the DC Multiverse in package images of the next wave. So here is the Damian Wayne Robin package images front back side. And the official images of the figure as well. Really great looking figure in my opinion. And you have the drowned front back side, Earth 22 Batman. From the Dark Knight's Metal storyline. Here's the official images of her, her trident, car, the stand. Back side of her as well. You have the Red Sun Superman in this way. Official inbox images. Some action poses. You see he comes with a flight stand, extra hands, car. Front back side of him on his flight stand. And then you have the Batman from the Dark Knight's Death Metal. Package images. Some action poses. Shows the card and the figure stand. Front back side of this figure. Jumping over into NECA now, we have the official in package images of the Toonie Terrors. So here is Ash, front and back of the package. This is Bloody Ash, I should say. Here is the Creep from Creep Show, front and back of the package. Ghost Face from Scream. And 
and Michael Myers from Halloween. This is the bloody variant of him. On Super 7, we have some reaction Thundercats figures, and these are the retro toy line look to these. You have Lion O, Mumra, and Jackalman. Here's Jackman in package. Lion O in package. And Mumra in package. Next, from Lenard Toys. We have some 7 inch and 12 inch scale predator figures. You got a jungle hunter predator and a berserker predator. 25 points of articulation. And then on the left is your 12 inch predator, which is the jungle hunter predator. And then you also have the city hunter predator, back at 7 inch scale here. Along with this, Lenar Toys has also given us another line of the 7 inch alien figures. She got a couple of xenomorphs. I like the xenomorph with the uh, doll, that's one of my favorites. Then you have a blue one and a white one. Next, for Mondo Monday last week, we have a Hasbro Nerf. Anvin Phase Pulse Blaster so from the Mandalorian. And there's what it looks like in package. So from Mondo Mondo, also we got from Mission Fleet figures, we have the Biker Scout Speeder Bike. We also have the Mission Fleet figures for Defend the Child. Comes with Cara Dune as well, IG-11, and the Swamp Trooper. And then also for Mission Fleet, you have the Blur and Quill Battle Charge. Target exclusive box set here for the Pop Funkos. It has a Moff Gideon Collector's Box. Transformers WFC Bumblebee and Spike Wiki 2 pack here. From Funko Pops again, you have the Disney Adventures of the Gummy Bears figures. So you got Gruffy, Sunny, Cubby, Zummy, and Tummy. So no granny. From Sentinel, 6 inch fighting armor Captain America figure here. Really cool looking armor here. Some action poses of him throwing the shield and whatnot. Some Sentinel's putting out some pretty cool stuff. There's this figure stand as well. Shield plugs into the back of the back. From Hot Toys, you got a 1-6 scale Cyberpunk 277 figure. Tease. Transformers Cyberverse Starscream Seeker Strike figure. APC Toys, APC number 5 prototype images of the Prime RC. Unofficial. Transformers Retro Headmasters Wave 2. You got Highbrow here. Nice promotional shot. Very G1 look to this packaging. You also have Skull Crusher, the Gator. Another shot of him in his G1 look. And then we have Weird Wolf. It's a nice wave too in my opinion. There's his G1 look. Final packaging for the NECA Ultimate Stalker Predator figure.
love these NECA packages here, the little window box and the Velcro closing there. One six scale Power Rangers figures are going to be coming from 3-0, so that's kind of an announcement coming soon. Flame Toys gave us a model IDW Rodimus color image. Got all kinds of hands you can swap out. It's got the guns. It's got it's pretty cool. Action poses of him. Storm Collectibles gives us a preview of their 112 scale Gold Max Death Adder. And jumping back into Hasbro, we have the Power Rangers Wave 8 figures. So we got the Lost Galaxy Red Ranger, the SPD Pink Ranger, Zeo Green Ranger, and the Dino Thunder Blue Ranger. Kind of a lackluster wave in my opinion, but let me know what y'all think of it. Here's that Dino Thunder Blue Ranger with and without his helmet on. Lost Galaxy with and without his helmet on, Red Ranger. Zeo Green Ranger with and without his helmet. And SPD Pink Ranger with and without her helmet. NECA has given us the official inbox images of Doc Brown here for the Back to the Future Ultimates. There's an image of the figure as well. Metacom uh, showed off these toys. Not really even sure what they are. Crazy looking little animal human form figures. Project I can't even pronounce it, guys. Sorry. You can try to read it at the bottom. Interesting looking. We have from Bandai, America's Anime Heroes line expands with One Piece. You got Luffy, Zoro, and Sanji. There is your Luffy figure. There is your Zoro. And here is your Sanji. Here's all three kind of in action. Seven inch Fortnite Plastic Patrol official from McFarland. Here is the package. So back of the package, side of the package, and then action. Front back side. From Pop Vinyls. Funko, we have the new Garbage Pail Kids, Split Kit, J Decay, Leaky Lindsay, and Ally Gator. Bubba Fett prototype from Jumbo Action Figure. This is from General Giant, Premier Guild members only. Pre order Friday, December 11th. Guys, you probably missed that. If you didn't go out and get it this week. And for Funko Pops, for the Star Wars, you have the 2021 Valentine's Day figures, Darth Vader, Stormtrooper, Chewbacca, and Yoda. Super 7 Transformers, Super Cyborg Soundwave G1 colors. Funko Pop Retro Transformers Nemesis Prime, exclusive from, hmm, I don't know where it's going to. Funko Pop Retro Transformer Star Screen Target Exclusive Reveal. And Franz Hobby MB15 Naval Commander Full Color Production Images shown here. Nice trailer shots there. There's his back and him in his semi form. Then from Mech Fan Toys, Mechma V605B Commander. Check out that tail. Tell me what that's going to show us. We're going to see that this guy converts into a gator. That's awesome. And he's got that little mini figure that comes in him as well. 
112th scale Joker from Patriot Studios, Arthur Joker Fleck. Nice face sculpts there of Joaquin Phoenix. From Apex Legends, we got three new figures. We have an Octane, Revenant, and Wraith. From WWE, we got all kinds of reveals for some figures here. Seeing some Triple H, some Edge, The Rock with the Car, Undertaker, Roman Reigns, Otis. Tucker, Tony Storm, Dusty Rhodes, King Corbin, Sasha Banks, and we got the uh, Drew McIntyre as well. And then an official in package image of the Battle Armor He Man from the He Man Origins line, deluxe figure here. All right, so jumping into the honorable mentions for the week. For honorable mention, we do show some images of the Super 7 Ultimates Turtles in package. Bebop, Shredder, Leonardo, and Jimin. We'd be real excited to start getting those in hand. And figure list, put out this awesome shot of a Cannonball Legs conversion kit. Of course, this is bogus. But just imagine if this is what they actually did. So here we are at the top 10 part of the week. So here are the top 10 best toy reveals of the week. From 112th Mezco Collective here, we have the Predator. And he comes with that skull there on the right hand side. Flash effects that come out, different head sculpts, light up effects. Mesco's got some pretty stuff, cool stuff going on. Two interchangeable mouthpieces as well. Really cool. Check out that face sculpt and the helmet. Oh my gosh. Mesco did some pretty good work on this one. And from Mythic Legions, we have some awesome looking images for this next wave that's coming out. But the biggest one that I want to talk about is definitely in the bottom left corner, the Alder Moose. That is crazy. How many times we've we seen a moose action figure? I also like the Alferus Decibalis, the bottom there, Elithia, Phobus, and Varg. Some of my favorites from these Mythic Legions. Next line. And number eight from Marvel Pop Vinyl Zombies here. Check out all these zombies. You got Mystique, Doom, Moon Knight, Gambit, Modok, Thor, She Hulk, Red Hulk, and Rogue. Nice. Gotta love the Marvel Zombies. Really cool. And number seven from Transformers Red or Robot. Enhanced design. You have the coronation suit or coronation star screen from the movie. There he is with his crown and his cape. And also revealed at the same time is the Bumblebee figure. And number six from McFarlane Toys Mortal Kombat. We have the Shao Kahn figure. And we do it at the same time. There is in the package. And the different sides. Built at the same time as the Liu Kang. And there he is in package, different sides, and also the Shadow Skin Scorpion revealed. Package, all the different sides. Number five from NECA, we have the Alien 40th Anniversary Wave 4. You got the Lambert in her compression suit. I love that face sculpt. That is amazing. She's so scared. But also we have the Geiger's alien. 
integrated improvements here. And then we have Ripley in her suit. Doing good job, Sigourney Weaver. Number four, again, the figure, one stick scale from Sh uh, Sideshow Toys. Really nice. I love the soft goods on this. Different head sculpts, different hair sculpts there. All the kinds of different hands you can put on it. It's got its bow staff. Check out all those hands he comes with. That's crazy. Number three from 3 0, you have the 1 6 scale G.I. Joe Storm Shadow figure to go along with the Snake Eyes figure that they've announced as well. Really cool looking figures. All the different sides. And then all together, all your different angles. 3 0 doing some cool stuff, and I love that Hasbro's actually putting it on there. Uh, has a pulse website to, to allow them to sell this and also Super 7 toys as well. Number two, all kinds of stuff from New Age toys. You got your H3 X Harry and H3 T Harry, which is Prowl. This Prowl figure looks amazing. There he is from the back in action. Here's in his car form. Some weapons. But also released the same time. It's the translucent version of him. car they also announced some more we had this uh, Galvatron last week but here is a H23M and H23T versions of Darius they call him this is more of the gray color different heads face sculpts that you can put in him in action there's his cannon back of the figure and here's the translucent version These things look amazing. Really cool. You can see the uh, Megatron right behind him. Then you have this other version here with this Unicron looking planet that goes along with him. There's your Unicron, so I don't know when we're going to see that. Also, we have the New Age Toys 823 Machio or Megatron they're calling him. I don't like this one as much. There he is in his jet form, I guess. And then you have the new age toys Straxus or H23B. Haralder. I don't care as much for this one either. And then at number one, McFarlane Toys done it again. DC Multiverse Batman Beyond figure coming in spring 2021. This is pretty awesome. I know we've been complaining about all the Batmans are giving us, but I love this figure. Good job, McFarlane. So guys, what do y'all think about this top 10 list for the week? Dimensions. Would you guys have put one of the other ones on this list? Did you enjoy this week's reveals? Let me know in the comments. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video of the top 10 best toy reveals of the week. Leave any kind of comments that you want. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys later. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.